And here at home, veterans and surviving family members were honored at the VFW Post 9854 in Vinton. The ceremony highlighted two World War II veterans and the blood shed during the war. KPLC's Amasiraba was there. This is a date which will live in infamy, something we will remember forever because we were attacked on our soil. One buddy poppy at a time was laid to rest, symbolizing the blood shed from veterans during the war. The event was held on National Pearl Harbor Remembrance Day to keep history alive. Event organizer Debbie McElhannon says events like this are necessary. It's very important to continue to thank them because they were willing to write a blank check. They were willing to die for our freedom. They went to war not knowing if they were gonna come back or not. One of those veterans who went to war was the father of Steve Lanier. Pearl Harbor is special to us because my father served in the Pacific Theater. He did uh, visit Pearl Harbor through his service time. Lanier says he remembers growing up, it was a taboo to ask World War II vets about the experience due to the trauma that came with memories. So it's been events like this that has helped him learn the history of the war. In later years, they begin to talk more. And so this was a wonderful thing that we got to attend some of the reunions of the veterans before they stopped having reunions. And so this is very educational and very essential to this history be recorded, to be passed on. And on days like this, he remembers his father's good fight for the country and what it was like for him. Uh, he would say, we thought we were goners. And uh, he said, you never get as tired or as fatigued as you'll get is when you're in combat. And if you survive, you know, you live to tell about it. Amos Zerbo, 7 News.